It's two separate categories for me personally. I'd say one is our team. I'd say any group is only as good as their team and we've definitely sought out the best people we could in the industry. Um, super qualified groups who are very thoughtful about what they do um, and really brilliant with in terms of ideas, um, pathways they want to take. And so I'd say our team is by far the most important piece of what sets Phylos apart from everyone else. We also really focus on research and development and unlike most groups, our focus is really through a scientific lens and so we are incredibly intentional about everything that we do here. So this is part of our, you know, really rigorous scientific approach to, to this whole process. Test our seeds for emergence. We make sure that we're not selling seed that you're, you're going to grow and only have a few emerge. We also do a lot of genotype testing to make sure our seeds are true to type, um, that we don't have any accidental outcrosses. On the safety side, we test all our mother plants, all our parent lines for HLVD and other diseases to make sure those types of diseases aren't present in our genetic material, therefore that those diseases never get transferred down to our seed products, never get into the hands of our customers. My background is in genetics, and so when we talk about the quality of the seeds, we're testing the background of these seeds every time we make a batch. We're really testing for that uniformity that the grower is going to see by looking at the genetic background. We've got flower quality that looks as good as a clone in a lot of cases, and now we're working on putting those aromas into the lineup. The breeding team's impact on the final customer's grow is going to be all in the performance of those plants. So not only are those plants going to be starting off HLVD free, we've trialed them enough to be able to give you good information on, okay, how tall is this plant going to be? How much THC is it going to produce? Is it going to be purple? Is it going to be purple green? Is it going to be green? Is it going to smell orange or is it going to smell gassy? So all of those things we've trialed out multiple times. We've seen these plants in multiple environments and that's going to allow us to tell you as a customer what to expect. Every single seed should be exactly what you have been told on the, the data sheet that it's going to be. So if it's going to reach 19% THC, that's what you should expect to see. 